Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol GE, General Electric. We will take a look at the 30-minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30-minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. Quite the eventful day today, not only from the price action standpoint, but you look down here at the volume and well above average volume on the day. So a lot of eyeballs on this one moving forward. And, you know, it's a situation where there, there are certain areas here on the chart now that a lot of people are going to be watching. And I, I make that comment because when lots of people are watching the same areas and wondering the same thing, Call it a self fulfilling prophecy, call it whatever you want. It can definitely produce some very dynamic movements and the level that a whole lot of people are going to be watching, so this is not some sort of great discovery on my part or anything like that, is right down here around $6 and let's just call it 22 cents. If you go back through the history of the chart, you can see that this general area right here has quite a bit of history of holding strong. And it's one of those levels where you, you can look at it a couple different ways. If you're looking at this as a you know, potential bounce point, hey, that makes a whole lot of sense. I mean, the last couple of times the price has been down here, some very nice bounces have happened. Now, don't get me wrong, and I wish I could say trading was this easy. Just because it's bounced from that area before does not mean that for sure guaranteed it's going to bounce again. My point here is that's at least a valid and a rational thought. For example, let's say the price had never bounced from there, and I'm sitting here saying, hey, it's looking like the price could bounce from around 622. You'd be totally justified to say, what are you talking about? Based on what? Like, wh why would you say that? But in this situation... Does it, you know, it has bounced from there. So is it a guarantee to bounce? No. Is it a valid, rational thought? Absolutely. But on the flip side of that, it's also a more than valid thought to think that if the price comes down to here, behaves in that manner, and then breaks to the downside, that could very well create quite a bit of downward selling pressure as that would be a, a very key technical break to the downside. So yeah, it, it's held very nicely in the past, but if it doesn't hold up, then that will freak people out. And like I said, self-fulfilling prophecy or not, that could cause a lot of downward selling pressure. If there is any sort of attempted bounce to the upside, key level of resistance is going to be right up there at 645. But as of right now, with the amount of downwards pressure, really just a question of you know where this thing can potentially find some buyers at, and we'll see if that's at 622 or not. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I want to invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too, good, way too good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.